Hello, I have tried to film this video three times and I keep running out of storage but hopefully I've got enough now so I'm just gonna redo what I've just done <laughs> and show you what I've got in my massive body shop delivery haul. So I started unboxing this massive box of stuff and I've got the bits here and then we've got this little box here hopefully I won't run out of storage but I'm just gonna go through the bits that I already took out to show you. So we have a lot of Christmas bits in here. So first we've got the Calm and Chamomile Cleansing Gift. This is really, really good for anybody who wears makeup, or even if you don't, but mostly for people who wear makeup, because you get the full size Chamomile Cleansing Butter, which is amazing, and the eye makeup remover as well, and a muslin cloth. So this is like a super cute gift. Next, one of my favorite gifts is if you or someone that you know loves a face mask this is a really cute stocking for the gift as well or just a main gift but you do get three of the mini expert facial masks so you get the himalayan charcoal which is really good for your oily t-zone the chinese ginseng and rice which is really good for exfoliating so that would be like cheeks and the coffee one which is really good for energizing a lot of people put that under the eye area to sort of awaken the eye area and you also get a super soft festive head, ma head mask headband <laughs> that you can wear while you're putting your face masks on so i think this is such a cute gift you can either multi-mask or you can use them one at a time but absolutely love that this i've already opened to show but you get the idea this comes all tied up this is the happy and hydrated vitamin e skincare gift perfect for this time of year because everyone's skin is getting a bit dry you get the vitamin e sheet mask at the back there you get the vitamin e skin cooling gel mist which is also really good for the summertime and they've put in here the intense version of the moisture cream so like i said perfect for this time of year because i don't know about you but my skin is suffering <laughs> next Christmas gift wise we have this I think this is such again such a cute gift is probably gonna be my phrase of the day people going past the window um, but this is the flutter and flick eye makeup gift so if you know somebody who wears eye makeup there is an eye definer here the happy go lash mascara which is what I'm wearing right now and a mini version of the caramel cleansing butter this is just how cute is that? Really good for travelling, on the go, in your handbag. This is a lovely gift. Next, I think this is a good idea as well. The Hug and Squeeze Hand Cream Crackers. How adorable is that? Like if you've got people coming around Christmas Day and you want to split them up between people instead of like normal crackers, everyone's got a little gift or you can split them up and give them in stockings. They could be just like a little gift as well, but it's, I just love the fact that you could just open it up and split it up between people. Really good idea. Next, this isn't Christmassy, but I've just got some exfoliating bath, exfoliating bath gloves for in the bath or the shower. If you don't have enough time to use a scrub, then you can just use these. I've got two of the Kindness and Pears hand wash this is one of our three festive ranges this year so these will be gone after christmas and the kindness and pears is my absolute favorite if you love the like sweet um what was i gonna say so the, the sweet and fruity scents then kindness and pears is the one if you liked juicy pear from the previous ranges then you'll really like this another thing that i've got from that range is the fragrance mist now this is divine <laughs> like normally a fragrance mist you'd expect it to smell especially a fruity one you'd expect it to smell like that sort of teen <clears throat> excuse me teenagery like really overly sweet fragrance and this is sweet but i mean i'm gonna use this one because this is mine but it actually 
it smells like pear, but it also smells like perfume. And I think that's really, really good because you don't want to walk around, like I'm 27, I don't want to walk around smelling like a teenager, but I do love sweet scents. And I love the fact that this smells so wearable day to day and people would actually be like, oh, you smell good, what's that? And it's sweet, fruity, but also like a fragrance. I don't know, I can't explain it, but highly recommend the fragrance mist if you like sweet scents, because it's beautiful. So I've got two of them. I've also got the shower gel and the body scrub. Look at the colour of the body scrub. Another thing to note as well is that everything new, like all of these things and every product coming in um, is vegan. Look at that. <laughs> so green, but it's a sugar scrub. But yeah, all of these products that I've just shown and a lot of ones we've already got are being reformulated to become vegan because the body shop is gonna be vegan by 2023, which is really good. So next I have the French lavender pillow mist. This is really, really good because the smell of lavender just relaxes you. And I feel like I have a better night's sleep when I've used this on my pillow. I don't know whether it's placebo, but honestly, this is the best lavender sleep mist I have ever used. So, in terms of like seeing an effect from it. But yeah, that's where I got to before it stops. So, I'm gonna get the massive box and I'm gonna carry on. So, next, uh, it's in a box. I have the Kindness and Pears. Can you tell this is my favorite range? Kindness and Pears body butter. So these are all now 96 hours of hydration. Oh no, that's doing it properly. There you go. <laughs> but that always, it's like untouched snow. You don't want to ruin that, but so good. They actually have like a patented design as well where you could literally hold it over your head and like, it wouldn't come out. Yeah. Oh, I have two of those. And I also have the almond milk. Almond milk? Almond milk? How do you say almond? <laughs> but have the almond, almond milk body butter as well. A sensitive skin. Also got the almond milk and honey calming and protecting body lotion. I have a lot of my customers who love the almond milk range. I mean, it is verging into just almond milk, not almond milk and honey. Um, and I just didn't have any in my stock, so I got some. The CBD Soothing Oil Balm Cleansing Mask. Flipping love this stuff, it's beautiful. If you've got stressed out skin, this is perfect. Like when I've got like a flare up of spots or whatever, or dry patches or anything, I'll use the CBD range for a week and my skin is just replenished. I see the effects within like four days, I love it. The Oils of Life Intensely Revitalising Cleansing Oil in Gel. A lot of these things I just have because I haven't got them in my stock at the minute and I like to demo them for my customers. So I was running low on one of them. I've got, for any white musk super fans of the last however many years, um, I've got a white musk roll-on perfume, which is fairly new. So it's sort of like the older style ones, just to keep in your handbag if you like the white musk. And then I've got, as I just said, my favourite day moisturiser is the CBD moisturiser. Changed my skin. It always does. Whenever I get lax on my skin routine, it changes my skin. It's beautiful. Almond milk body yoghurt. This is the one for sensitive skin, vegan, dries within 15 seconds, so really good. And you can put it on damp skin as well. Really good if you just wanna moisturize, but be quick about it. I have another Kindness and Pears body scrub. <gasps> I need to open this. Now, I don't know how to say it properly. Tahitian tiara, Tahitian tiara, yeah hand wash this is part of our spa of the world range and it smells like absolute 
luxury heaven that's why i got it i just thought you know when oh, it smells like i don't know luxury the only way i could describe the smell of luxury it smells like that it smells rich it smells creamy it smells luxury and you know sometimes you just want something that's just feels a bit nicer when you're washing your hands you can just be like oh i don't know turning washing your hands into an experience but it smells beautiful so i think every time i'm gonna wash my hands a little bit of that <laughs> i have another christmas gift love these so like i said the three festive ranges that we have for christmas this is them so we have kindness and pears we have love and plums and we have joy and jasmine and these are the three hand creams from that range this is a nice little gift especially if you don't know what sort of scent someone would like they've got a bit of everything there i've got another kindness and pears hand wash this is a good gift i love our lip balms and lip butters and this is the cupid's bow and mistletoe lip balm gift and you open this and you've got what scents are there You've got a watermelon, two strawberry and a raspberry. And they are so nice. Like this is how, this is the first product that I use from the body shop. I used some of my friends. Um, oh, what was it? It was like a berry flavor. It was a purple one. But um, yeah, love them. So that's nice. This is cute. They've changed the packaging. It's the strawberry EDT and I've just sprayed the pear oh that was weirdly satisfying i'm gonna do it again just me oh i want to smell it oh that was a satisfying thing <sighs> so sweet that's yummy see that doesn't smell like fragrance you can tell that the other one is fragrant that's a real pain to get back on that's really really sweet things like this i like to leave by the bedside because you can just give yourself a little spritz before you get into bed and you get into bed smelling like a strawberry or a mango or a satsuma or whatever you prefer but that's what i would use that for then i was running out of my perfume perfume i was running out of my that doesn't look like my shade does it <laughs> oh well um, ran out of my foundation so I have the fresh nude foundation SPF 15 I find that it suits my skin better because out of the two um, I've got dry skin so the matte clay would be too much for my skin this is the most hydrating one so I go for that then I've got the lemon purifying hand wash I've got a lot of hand wash <laughs> I guess we all need it I've got a rose dewy glow face mist I have needed this. This has got like light reflecting particles in it as well. It smells like British Rose and it's got light reflecting particles which just really help give your skin a boost and a glow. I've got the orange one which I don't even think they sell anymore but it's gotten like look how oh that is and it's gotten to the point where it spits at me so yeah it's not great. I wonder what that was then. Oh I've got two of those. Then I've got a Kindness and Pears hand cream. Don't sound good. I've got two of these actually, facial facial mask brushes. These are really, really good to ensure that you don't waste any product because when you're using like fingers for face masks, obviously that feels gross anyway. I don't know whether you care about that, but I do. I feel like it feels gross to put face mask on with your fingers. I don't like it. Um, so I prefer to do it with a brush, but you also use less product, which means less waste and win-win. They're just really nice and easy to apply. Then I've got the Shea Shampoo. Is that the sha no, I haven't. That looks exactly like shampoo. I've got the Shea Shower Cream, but the packaging has changed and it's now vegan. I've got another Kindness and Pears Hand Cream. I've got an almond milk and honey hand cream. These are changing as well to hand balms, but they haven't changed yet. I've got an almond nail and cuticle manicure oil. I nearly said that really weird, manicure oil. But it basically has like the cuticle pusher on the end, and then you take this off, 
you have you twist the end and almond cuticle oil comes out at the end and you can do your cuticles with it love this because i'm really really bad for like picking and biting at my the, the skin around my fingers i know it's disgusting but i'm trying to stop and that always really helps me and it helps keep my nails in a really strong and nice condition and then i've got the himalayan charcoal purifying clay wash always forget about this gem it's really really good cleanses purifies skin unclogs pores so as well i think it's really good when teenagers are starting to want to use cleansers and things to help with any skin issues and oil that's a really good one for them to try next i've got the insta glow cc cream i really like using this underneath my foundation to give it a glow i haven't got it on today but i usually do wear it underneath my foundation and that's in the bright glow because i'm pale i've then got the mint mattifying face mist so if you struggle with oily skin and after your makeup or even if you don't wear makeup you just want to spritz your face and it'll mat it i have another almond milk body yogurt and i've got a different face mist i've got the cocoa calming face mist smells like coconut and it hydrates soothes and it's make it friendly i've got the cbd restoring facial oil i use this in my skincare routine again like i said the whole cbd skincare range is just incredible if you want a skincare range you are going to see results from then it's the cbd it's a bit pricier but it's worth it Then I've got the almond milk shower cream. I've got another kindness and pears shower gel. I've got this, I've wanted this for ages, the detangle and smooth oh, detangling comb. I thought this might be good because I use the Shea or the banana, depends, um, hair mask. And I thought if I put this in the shower, when I put the hair mask on, I could use this to sort of like comb it through my hair, see how we get on with that. So we've got that. And then from this box, this box is done and I've got a load of sheet masks. So I've got the Youth Concentrate Sheet Mask with three plant stem cells, instant hydration, fresher, bouncier and healthier skin. And again, this is one of those products where I see the results from, absolutely love this face mask. So yeah, quite a few of those. Lastly, we've got this little box here. And then we'll be done. So I have a couple more of the fragrance mists. I just wanted to make sure that I had some <laughs> because if I start like shouting the roof about it, my customers are gonna want it and I'm gonna have to have it before it goes. Otherwise, how am I gonna give it to them? Um, there is also the Own Your Naturals oh, no. eyeshadow palette. Can I open it? This is for a customer, so I don't wanna destroy it. No, I won't open it, but that is the Own Your Naturals eyeshadow palette. Beautiful. We've got a mango hand cream. Oh, love this. That's my favourite so far. Whoops. Although I think the Kindness and Pears is going to be my favourite now. I've got the Lemon Purifying Face Wash. Helps wash away bacteria and impurities. People are loving this. Like... I lived with my partner's mom for a bit and she started using it. I found out that my partner is using it when he sees it in the shower. Like, everyone's loving this. I tend to use this in the shower um, to wash my face with. And yeah, just a great, a great one that everyone seems to love. Oh my gosh, I'm going to have loads of these. Kind of a pair of shower gel. I've got another one because I've got an order for one. The lemon face wash. I've got... I've got the Lash Sport Waterproof Mascara. It's the only waterproof mascara that we do. But yeah, really good if you go to the gym and you want to wear mascara and you don't want it to fall down your face or maybe you go into an emotional play at your child's school. I don't know. <laughs> uh, and then I've got the Ginger Shampoo and Conditioner. This is for dry, flaky scalp. 
It's also anti-dandruff, anti-dandruff shampoo. And the ginger conditioner is for dry scalp and weak hair. Scalp care. Hmm. And then I have another hand care gift set. Palms and Pinkies Hand Cream Trio, which has the Shea, Almond Milk and Honey, and the Strawberry. Nearly done. And then, to shed load of um, sheet masks. If you didn't know already, as a consultant, oh my god. As a consultant, we get um, freebies and 70% off. So when I got my freebies, I just went, hello, I'll just have every sheet mask there is. I didn't get the seaweed because um, not as many of my customers have the seaweed. So I just got a load of sheet masks for my stock. And I can do them for like giveaways and freebies and competitions and things. And they're just really, really good to have. Um, yeah, so in there I've got the aloe. Hello. Calm sheet mask for hydrated, settled and soothed skin. Really good for sensitive skin. Then I've got some more of the Youth Concentrate sheet mask, which I've already shown you. Then I've got the Vitamin C Glow sheet mask for hydrated, awakened and healthier skin. These are really good to use on Sundays as well, because Sundays are my sort of look after yourself day. And a Vitamin E Quench sheet mask for hydrated, hydrated, softer and smoother skin. So yeah, got a few of them. And that is the end of my massive, 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 massive haul. <laughs> um, yeah, if you'd like to see more of these videos, then give it a thumbs up and subscribe because I'm gonna be back doing videos. I'm so excited. And yeah, if you'd like to see anything, see a review of anything, literally anything you wanna see, let me know to do with Body Shop because it's what I do, um, yeah. So make sure to subscribe if you want to see more and I will see you for my next video, whatever that is.